Yes, how's it going? So we're on episode 4 squared right now, and I hope you guys can figure that out because it is pretty awesome. And we are going to make probably about the same thing that we've been doing, but what I'm going to do is something a little bit different. I'm going to try out these new spiky guys, so uh, I gotta do something about that that's a little bit different. Um, hopefully it won't matter too much, and let's get started here. I'm kind of leaving out these snow peas and these uh, repeater guys. And, um, well actually, you know what, I'm gonna get snow peas. Let's get, you know what, let's get these guys. You know, I don't even know anymore, really. I'm just kind of making stuff up as I go. Let's, uh, let's just see what happens. Always sunflowers to begin. That's the best way to go. I noticed there was actually quite a few, uh, Zamboni guys, Zamboni guys out there. Which can be very scary. I don't like those guys often. There's also some of those jumper guys and everything. So... I don't know how easy this one's gonna be. I mean, it seems like we're having no problems for the past, like, four rounds, so I'm really not too worried about anything, if you know what I mean. And, uh, yeah, just like always, I mean, the only thing I really don't like about this game is that the exact, the beginning's pretty much the exact same thing the entire time. You know, it's like, just make sunflowers, get a couple potato mines, make sunflowers, make sunflowers, you know, I mean... I guess you do have to set up, and that's the way strategy games usually go, but it's like doing the exact same thing every single time. Like, for example, Bloom Star Defense, at least you can make a few different types of towers. But, uh, this one, it's not quite so lucky. Meh. I wonder what- I wanna see what those spike weeds do. For a hundred dollars, it's better not just wear off after one zombie. I'm hoping at least two to three zombies. Or something along those lines. But if it lasts forever, that'd be way sweeter. I don't know how that would work, but hey, you never really know, I guess. You never really know. Money. Alright, well, let's get one of these guys now. Start defending. Instead of just making all these potato mines. Can't do that forever. Destruction of zombie heads. That's all I love to do. I wonder why they shoot peas. You know, why not shoot something cooler, like, I don't even really know, to be honest, but, you know, you could always find something even cooler than that. I don't even know, I can't even think, like, why not shoot, like, strawberries or something, just as an example. Why shoot peas? Just, just out of curiosity. <gasps> oh, that was perfect, that was really close, I would have been almost screwed if I didn't get that guy done. You know, we're getting conehead zombies pretty fast in here. Let's at least walnut him. I like to start walnuts pretty soon just because they do take so long to actually uh, come back. So it's usually not about the money problem, it's usually the problem of trying to wait for him to come back because he takes forever. And getting lots and lots of money here. Fantastic. Orgasmic. Delicious. And let's get another early pad here, and then we'll get one of these, another one of these three guys. I got lots of sunflowers this time. Ooh, money. I almost lost that one. My wallet almost got eaten, though. It's kind of surprising, I guess. Hopefully he'll die in time before he eats a sunflower. Hopefully. I think he will. And more money. I'm actually paying attention to the money this time, guys. You guys like it? I know I do. Let's get another walnut here. Got that for sure, so not a big deal. Pretty intense here. So let's at least test this out. Let's see. I got enough money. Let's see what happens. So I, it's still there. Let's see. I don't really know. So I'm gonna have to get a couple more guys for the top here. Um, we'll get one of these guys at least. So I'm really kind of straying away from the, the blue guys here for a while. I think I used to really like them, but I don't know if I really want to keep them very very much longer. They're kind of becoming obsolete with my awesome three three Peters coming on here and everything. So we get another three round thing um, where three huge rounds of zombies are coming, which is sometimes scary. Let's see what happens when they walk over that spike strip. So the spike strip, I guess it damages them, damages them somehow. 
but it doesn't really, I don't really know how much exactly because it's just kind of hard to tell if you guys can realize that. Tons and tons of money. You guys are lucky I'm such a fast clicker. I'm the fastest clicker in the internet. No, not really. But hey, why not? Let's pretend I am. Oh, I missed the money again. I pay attention to too much sun. Let's get some more lily pads up here. And a walnut. Walnut right in front of that plant, like usual. Money. Seems like I haven't really seen any gold or anything recently, though. Which is kind of bad. Um, I wish I got more money. Because I actually want to save up for some of those super awesome towers that are going to come up. That'd be really sweet. Three. Three of these guys already. Gotta get a walnut pretty soon again. Oh, another. Oh, no. Another huge wave of zombies. This is wave number two of the huge wave of zombies. Look at the heads between these guys and these guys. It's way bigger. Guess you can't really fit that many, but meh. Meh. What are you gonna do? So I got that walnut. Uh oh, there's the uh, Zamboni. I just have to put another plant here. Alright, let's just do that. Those plants are just gonna save my life all the time with <laughs> against those guys. I'm pretty much always gonna pick up plants. Oh no! another one. Well, whatever. It worked out, I guess. Not too big of a deal. So, the spike strips do last forever. At least that's what it seems like. Um, they don't seem like they do that much damage, though. That's really the only problem I, I can really see. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Stupid thing didn't work the way I planned it. So let's just, uh... You guys know how this works. Get enough sun, start building more awesome towers. And boy do I have a lot of awesome towers. Look at this amazing cast of defense I got right here, guys. Last two rows, complete P explosions. Even with Buckethead Zombies being, like, impossible to kill. Oh, crap. That was close. That was close, guys. Why do I always do that? I don't know. I don't know. Well, you guys probably saw me watching some random video and some random ads. I don't even remember what that video was, really. Is that the end? Oh, here's the last huge wave of zombies. Get a walnut. Get a plant. I got a bunch of plants here. Oh man, we'll be totally fine. No big dealio. Oh man, we need another plant though. Man, everything just gets squashed by those sandbones. Money, money, money. No oh, man, one of those sunflowers is definitely dead. At least one. Maybe two. Who knows? No, they died pretty fast. No big deal. You have so much money, you don't even really have to worry about it. There's like two left. Ooh, what is this? A fire log? I wonder what this fire log does. 175, it's kind of expensive. Um, let's see what it does. Peas that pass through it turn into fireballs. Hmm, that could be interesting. I don't know. I wonder how much stronger they get. I wish they told you how strong things were. That'd be pretty sweet. So um, that's all I got for this episode. Of course, always appreciate likes and everything like that. Um, let me know if you need anything else, and uh, have a really nice day.